Some individuals find it quite threatening to engage in role play in front of other people. And you've often got just one chance to do it. So the beauty of the Body Swaps program is that practitioners in their own time can try out scenarios as many times as they like and get consistent feedback. Working within medicine is very rewarding, but it can be tough too. When patients' well-being is under threat, when they feel powerless and misunderstood, they can respond with anger. I just don't understand it. Everyone says the NHS is underfunded, but if you stop being so bloody wasteful, you'd have more than enough money. And as pressures on many healthcare systems grow, staff are experiencing increasing levels of verbal and physical abuse from the frustrated public. So recognising anger and knowing when and how to react is an important skill. In this virtual simulation, we're going to be exploring some techniques you can use to navigate angry conversations more effectively. Have you ever been lost for words during an argument, only to think of all the things you should have said as soon as it's all over? Well, that's because in the heat of the moment, the primitive, non-rational part of our brains, the amygdala, takes over. It's perfectly normal. But if you're dealing with an angry patient, it's really important to be able to override those instincts because how you respond to a patient's strong emotion has a profound effect on their behaviour. Find us a real doctor to talk to. What are you, 15? And therefore, outcomes. So learning how to deal with these situations is important for you, for the patient, and for other patients that you're going to be seeing later on in the day.